Hello, I'm Tristan from Smart Home Point. I'll openly admit that when I bought my first smart light, I got confused by all the different terms. Is Wi-Fi or Zigbee better? Should the light be RGB or RGBWW or RGBW or RGBCCT? Should I care? And when I finally settled on Philips Hue, which is Zigbee and RGBCCT, by the way, I was then confused as to whether I should buy a white bulb, white ambience, or white and colour ambience. There's just too many terms. Right, whilst I won't talk about Zigbee or RGB CCT in this video, I will talk about what you definitely need to know about. The difference between the three different U-bulb types and when to buy each of them. So here I have the three types, Hue White, Hue White and Ambience, and make sure I don't drop them, and Hue Color, although its official name is Hue White and Color Ambience. Now, before I talk about the differences, it's worth quickly pointing out that my White Ambience bulb is a small candle bulb, whereas my other two are standard ceiling bulbs. But the, the three hue bulb types, white, white ambience and colour, exist in many different bulb formats. Be gentle, white. Okay, so let's take the easiest case, hue white. This smart bulb can be turned on and off and also dimmed. That's it. You can't change its colour, it just pumps out what's known as warm white. This is the sort of colour that you get in the evenings, during sunset, for example. Many non-smart bulbs are also set to warm white, which is around 2700K on the Kelvin light scale. So you might not have considered that there are natural bulb colours beyond warm white. But whilst this might sound like a boring topic, this is actually worth understanding, due to what hue white ambience offers. If you think of sunlight, due to atmospheric scattering effects, the colour of light actually changes throughout the day. During sunrise and sunset, for example, the light is fairly yellow or even sometimes red. This puts it to the left of the Kelvin scale, light scale. But as the day goes on, sunlight becomes more blue, also known as cool white. This puts it to the right of the Kelvin light scale. What this means in practice is that during the middle of the day, having loads of light stuck at warm white, such as this, can start to feel a bit odd, as though it's evening time in essence. Therefore, Philips Hue have bought out a white ambience offering, which allows you to change between warm white and cool white. In other words, to change between the main parts of the Kelvin light scale. In practical terms, this means you can have your smart light, for example, this one, pump out color that naturally reflects the time of day and ultimately the sunlight outside, which is quite nice. Finally, Philips Hue offers color bulbs. The official name is white and color ambience. It's also sometimes just called a full RGB bulb, meaning that you have full control over the colours that it produces. With this, you can change between 16 million different colour combinations. Not that you probably want to go through every single one, but you can do this via the colour wheel within the Hue app. And you can also use some really fun lighting effects that rotate between colours, or you can even mirror what's shown on your TV or your computer screen. Certainly, Hue colour bulbs are the most fun in that sense. Right, so that wraps up the functional differences between the three bulb types. Before I talk about the other key difference of each, which is the price, I wanted to mention that all three can be controlled in the same ways. You can use the Philips Hue app or Hue accessories, such as a dimmer switch or a motion sensor. You can also use third-party integrations, such as the routines and echo voice commands to control them as well. So the main difference of the, these three bulbs is the colour they produce and whether you have control over that colour or not. The other key difference, of course, is price. Hue colour costs more than Hue white ambience, and that itself costs more than Hue white. But to be more precise, this Hue white typically costs around $15, whereas Hue white ambience is around $22.50 each, whereas Hue colour is around $45 each. Although this varies, of course, depending on how many you buy, whether there's offers on, whether you buy them as part of a starter kit or anything else. But the main thing to note is hue white and color is often double the price of hue white ambience. Therefore, if you can afford hue color, you may want to just buy that because of the full range of RGB color control. But if you have a budget, you may be better off sticking to the white ambience bulbs or even the hue white ones. This is especially true if you're putting the bulb in a part of your house where you probably wouldn't want bright pink or green lighting. I actually find, personally, that I prefer white ambience the best. Being able to tweak the colour to match the time of day, remember the Kelvin light scale, is actually really nice. And these are half the price of the Hue colour bulbs, but your mileage may vary. 
And that just about wraps up today's video. I hope you found it useful. If you did, please click the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.